uh, stuck in that career because there is no not much growth in mechanical sector so i thought of uh, switching to uh, it sector then uh, i have uh, checking through google uh, what is the best course available uh, through that uh, i found the iq job Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. We are back with another testimonial. Today we have one of our job alumni with us, Kiran. He uh, is an alumni who has been recently placed in a company called Epsona as a software developer at a really good package. Today we talk to him to try to understand how he was able to do it since he is a 2020 graduate, that too in mechanical engineering. So let's get to know how his journey was, how he was able to crack this company, and if he has any sort of advice to freshers who are willing to get into this uh, industry. But before moving forward, take a moment to subscribe our channel and press the bell icon so that you are always notified on all our upcoming videos. Now without wasting any more time, let's jump into the session. Uh, hi Kiran, thank you so much for taking out time to do this with us. Uh, can you quickly introduce yourself to us? Yes, thank you. Uh, my my name is Guru Kiran Sai. I have completed my BA Mechanical in the year of 2020. Then uh, and I have worked as a junior design engineer for 1.5 years in Chennai, mm-hmm. which is located in Chennai. Then uh, I felt uh, stuck in that career because there is no not much growth in mechanical sector. So I thought of uh, switching to uh, IT sector. then uh, i have uh, checking through google uh, what is the best course available uh, through that uh, i found the iq job and previously there is a uh, we can attend the trial sessions for 15 days uh, without uh, enrolling so uh, just uh, by signing it up i have attended the classes for uh, i think it's 15 days and yes. i thought it's good um, the instructor is telling very well and yeah, because i am from mechanical right i don't know any i don't have any coding and knowledge obviously so um, mm-hmm. within that 15 days itself uh, i get a confidence that uh, i can able to learn through this course and i can also do coding so mm-hmm. then uh, i have joined this uh, iq job course from mm-hmm. there uh, and i have resigned for that company because uh, i felt that uh, doing the work in the morning and attending the classes uh, the core coding classes i think uh, it's difficult for me so i have mm-hmm. resigned for the job and uh, i have taken this course in, uh, from the starting um, uh, there there is modules basic dsc modules and after four months uh, i could have uh, have given me a option to uh, opt for a front end or back end whichever mm-hmm. i am comfortable Uh, I thought um, front end is better for me because uh, with the coding is little bit high in the back end, right? In in Java, and the, uh, we need to focus more on this. So I switch. Uh, I have chosen the front end part because it is. Uh, I think I thought it's uh, comfortable for me. Uh, from there, I have learned uh, React, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. And uh, in the back end as well, uh, IQ Job has taught me Node JS and Express JS module. But uh, after front end ka- completion, uh, placement readiness module, I, I, I'm eligible to attend for job placements, which is present in present in the IQ Job website. From mm-hmm. that, uh, I'm applying to the jobs. But um, uh, ja- generally, there is much competition, right? There are many people uh, attending the placements. and uh generally the interviews are taking place but uh no normally i i not got uh, placed in the uh, placed in some of the interviews some of the interviews has gone well and there is some delays in joining letters like like that all those things mm-hmm. and uh, parallelly i have tried to apply in the outside as well outside of the iq job through my friends and if there is any referrals like and uh, generally i am start revising my part uh, revising the concepts which i have which the in which class is taught but uh, the time is getting lag because uh, i think it's, it's uh, after completing the course it's been for two five months i think uh, uh, to till today hmm. but then uh, recently i, I have applied, applied through Acuja website itself. Uh, there is an app so not drive going on the Acuja website. So I have mm-hmm. applied to it. Okay. 
okay. and the thing is uh, the interviewer uh, is yeah, yeah the interviewer which uh, which is took me in this interviews he is already taken the interview from other company uh, that is with response financial technologies uh mm-hmm. that interview has gone well but uh, i think there is some delays in giving uh, joining letter of for that company so it did stop and uh, even in this interview uh, he given me uh, he given me assignment and after that uh, he given me technical questions and all those things so he told me um, the interview told me they will give a that, that means it's that it's not a complete uh, It's it like an internship, like that. Uh, they will see for six months. Uh, if mm-hmm. my performance is good, uh, they will carry on with it, like that. Got it. But uh, I am happy because uh, I'm struggling to get the uh, getting to the IT side. Right? The it's uh, it's very nice for me, and the package is uh, the offer is also mm-hmm. very very nice. Yeah, it's a great opportunity, uh, Kiran. Uh, so, like you have already explained, ki which module you took and what all things you have learned in Active Job. Uh, but I would like to understand one thing. Uh, you joined Active Job last year in February, right? So it's been more than a year for you now. Uh, so yes. tell us how was the experience in terms of what you liked the most? Uh, which uh, you know, which of the services probably, which of the tools you used the most uh, to upskill yourself, and what was the best part about the entire journey for you? Uh, from Accio job, which I have like this, that's uh, live classes. Because yeah. of that live classes and daily, they, uh, we need to complete the assignments in the portal itself. Daily, there will be after class, there will be ten to twenty problems related to the subjects which has taught in that class. It will yeah. help us. Uh, it will push the students because normally in many of the um, Uh, normal education uh, the, uh, platforms like uh, some other platforms for jobs mm-hmm. uh, for teaching these classes the generally there will be uh, there will be recorded classes in most of the courses uh, other than mm-hmm. job, there will be recorded classes because of that itself uh, many of the students will get detached with that course because uh, if there is no push for a student uh, he yes. will we, we will watch one or two videos After that, mm-hmm. uh, after two days, we will watch some other videos, and th- we will miss the continuity. And eventually, we also lose the interest in studying. But yes. through Active Job, which I like most, is live classes, and every month there will be mock interviews. There will be a uh, constant push from the Active Jobs. Uh, mm-hmm. We need to study. Uh, there is a, a mock test. We need to clear it. Because of that push itself, we will stick it to the books uh, without neglect. I I like that push. Best best yes. thing through it. That's nice, Kiran. So uh, you have been placed in this company now. Uh, when is your joining? Uh, Monday is my joining. Uh, first of July. Yes. Okay, got it. So you're looking forward to it. Look, working in a new environment. Yes, yes. I'm very happy to get this uh, because I'm switching from different. Uh, Sector, right? From mechanical, mm-hmm. I work there, and I'm going into the IT sector. I'm very happy to have this. Mm-hmm. So, Kiran, uh, so you have been a student with us for a long time now, right? Uh, you have studied a lot of concepts. Finally, you are going to be working in, in uh, your dream company. So, are you going to be studying the, uh, after this, or like will you be giving yourself some break for some time and then probably continue? No, uh, but. Uh, I am thinking that generally in many of the companies, uh, the DSA part is more important. Uh, I am not uh, that uh, good in that DSA part. I uh, uh, I try to uh, practice on some DSA problems uh, even weekly uh, in the weekends itself. I think uh, I am planning for uh, it. It will be useful for me in in the next uh, in career. Hmm. That makes sense. Uh, thank you, Kiran. Thank you so much for taking out time to do this with us. I hope people listening to you will surely find your story insightful, and will get started on their developer journey as soon as possible. And yeah, thank you so much for taking out time. We wish you all the best for your future. Thank you. So that was it, guys. I hope you all found it extremely insightful with Kiran. If you guys are also interested in making a career in coding, do make sure that you check out the link provided in the description box below. And if you guys are new to the channel, then don't forget to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you're always notified on all our upcoming videos. Thank you so much for tuning in on this one. We will see you next time.